Hey, what's going on guys? Toxic here, and this is the tutorial everybody has been waiting for. How to motion track in Windows Movie Maker. Yes, I finally have released this. Um, I got around to it to do the tutorial. I was waiting for it. The contest ended, it ended a couple days ago. So, I just want to say that... Uh, the people or the haters that said I use Cinema 4D and After Effects and Baju to motion track this, I want you guys in the comments to write, I'm sorry, Toxic, you were right. Because, first of all, you can't, you don't have to have Cinema 4D to motion track if you're doing 2D text. Second of all, I obviously didn't use After Effects, I used Windows Movie Maker. And I want to show that right now. So in the description, I have this cinematic that you guys can test it out on. Um, if you want to do this method, you're going to record something like this. You need kind of like a doorway. If you've seen um, my leftover episode 1 and 2, go check it out. In the beginning, it shows the cinematics you need to like make it look like this. You need it to make the effect look good and make it actually look like it's motion tracked but um i just have this if you wanted to use it it'll be in the description for you guys to download um so i cut it down a little bit and of course it's gonna be laggy um so we're just gonna start it about right there first of all uh yeah we'll just go to caption and i like doing it for four seconds and we're gonna add two text as you can see the time is only 4.59 um, and I'll show you how we're gonna extend it in a few so I'm just gonna use this font um, I, I have my own preferred fonts for motion tracking it looks better but I'll just use this we'll just do Windows Movie Maker tutorial and we're gonna put this up as you can see right now, you might not see that well just because it's so laggy. Um, you want to kind of center it in the middle like that. And you can see right now, it's not doing anything just because the text doesn't have any movement to it. To do that, I'm going to click on the text, go to text tools, go down, and click this one right here. Now it depends on how much you slow down, we'll get to that in a second. But usually you're going to click this. And what that's going to do is give it the effect that it's doing. Now as you can see it's not perfect. It's hard to see this because it's lagging. But it isn't perfect. Um, so what we're going to do, we need to slow down to 0 0.6. So now as you can see the, the length went up. I mean, let's watch the clip now. As you can see, it's 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 doing the effect that it's being motion tracked. Um, I don't know what else to tell you guys. That's oh my god, see what fireworks. Uh, that's about it. I mean, there's no other way to do it. It's that simple. Um, you just gotta work around with the speeds of the text and the speed of the clip. Um, it depends on how slow you have it go. When you go to text, you might need this one. But for me right now, I need it on the fast one. As you can see, it's being this motion tracked. Uh, like I said, guys, there's nothing else to show you. There's nothing else to do tutorial on. I mean, that's that's it. That's, that's how simple it is. A lot of people are saying, like, oh, this must take took you for hours to motion track this. As you can see, I did it within like a minute or so. I mean, it doesn't take that long to do it. Like I said, you need to play around with it a little bit. Um, just so it looks motion tracked. I mean, if you check out my Spratty at Countdown OCE, I motion track that using this method. Um, I'm also going to show you a second method. Probably the day after this is released or maybe two days after this is released I don't know yet but I'm gonna do a second method
So I hope you guys enjoyed this, and see you guys later.